Hello, I'm Evan Fotis and this is Face Facts. Today, with President Donald Trump, we will analyze his facial features in order to decode traits and predispositions of his true, of his inner personality. So, let us have a look, beginning from the outline, the outer frame, which determines the shape of the face. The outer frame is wide, showing physical energy and endurance, a personality not affected in depth by the surrounding circumstances or influences. There is strong will, recuperative powers, resistance, and some degree of obstinacy. The inner frame is formed by our sensory receptors, the eyes, the nose, and the mouth. It expresses our immediate reactions, our adaptability and sociability. The inner frame with the receptors, the eyes, the nose and the mouth are slightly retracted within the orifices, indicating a certain degree of introversion concerning emotional communication. But which are his predominant features? Eyes. There we can detect observation, calculation, but also suspiciousness. The mouth shows intensity of passions and inner conflicts. Let us see now each individual feature, one by one. Starting from the top zone A is the forehead. Donald Trump has a relatively flat upper forehead, but a well-developed muscular tissue on the lower region. It shows a doer instead of a thinker, one who is oriented towards practical and materialistic aspects of life rather than towards idealistic and theoretical pursuits. The muscularity shows intensity and constructive tendencies. It actually indicates the utilization of one's mental powers. Here we can have a short hint of how his forehead is formed. actually formed. In this rare occasion where Trump reveals his forehead in public, we can see the development of the muscular tissue as well as the inclination of the forehead, indicating impulsiveness of thought. And his hairline, shaped like the letter M, showing sense of superiority and arrogance. Donald Trump's eyebrows have an uneven wayward growth of the hair. This is an indication of erratic habits of thought and of emotional swings. Someone who has strong likes and strong dislikes. It shows occasional irritability and temper, and a strong urge to shut out or to turn a deaf ear to any opposition. When the eyebrows are located extremely low, crushing down upon the eyes, this indicates a calculative nature, with a predisposition to distrust, unwilling to expose his true emotions. Donald Trump has a narrow eye. Not the philosophical thinker, but one who must have the object to be analyzed actually in sight. It shows someone who is confidential and not easily exposes his inner feeling. The area between the brow and the eye is full and fleshy, covering the eyelid and the outer side. This shows uncontrolled passion and impulsiveness, with a predisposition to distrust and suspiciousness. Moving forward now, let us see what physiognomy says about the nose which is considered to be the barometer of the person's temperament. Donald Trump has a relatively short nose. This symbolizes a freer, less responsible nature, which might not mind bending the rules when necessary. On the other hand, the ridge of the nose is straight, something that is symbolic of a more refined disposition, with a love of art and music also of good organizational skills and a balanced judgment. Further down we meet the philtrum. The philtrum is the area between the mouth and the nose forming a channel which symbolizes the communication between our emotional and our physical forces. Donald Trump's philtrum is shallow, which is symbolic of a loss of self-esteem in the middle of life. What distinguishes the mouth from the other features is that it is located exactly between the instinctive and the reasoning forces. It is the one feature where all the person's inner conflicts are portrayed. It is a dynamic feature, changing micro-expressions 
according to our current emotional state and feelings. So how eloquent is the mouth of the character? Donald Trump's mouth is protruding from the profile. The philtrum slopes outwards. This shows someone who sets very high standards of personal behavior. He can be bossy, imperious. His temperament is prone to criticism. The lips are pouting, symbolizing immature and unpredictable behavior in what one might say or sulk. One who might not mind bending the rules when necessary. Chin and jaw. Our chin and jaw reveal our energy reserves and our natural force. A wide jaw with breadth and depth show possessiveness, perseverance, and tenacity of purpose. It indicates strong preservation instincts and recuperative powers. A chin with a muscular ball is a positive feature, shows a go-getter with positive nature, one who claims his personal wants and stands up for them. It also adds to the person's stability and well-being and is a sign of sociability. Cheekbones. High and visible cheekbones reflect pursuit and gain of power and authority. But when the cheekbones are bony, even if the rest of the face is fleshy, it reveals that the use of this power will not always be noble. As you might have noticed, there were some contradicting features, especially between the same personality. We saw contradicting meanings between different features. This is perfectly normal. Most people have contradicting features. So the temperament and the general shape of the face will determine which of our contradicting features come into play, are actively expressed in our everyday behavior. Closing now, how could one encapsulate Donald Trump's personality traits in one sentence? One could say that Donald Trump's character is a synthesis of inner conflicting forces, practicality and realism, emotional immaturity and vulnerability, introverted sensitivity but determination in action. So, this was Face Facts with Donald Trump. We saw what his face can reveal about his traits and predispositions of his inner personality, and how this can be communicated through his micro-expressions and the proportions of the features and the overall shape of the face. Please leave your comments below and thank you for watching.